This morning I saw the high heels that Ralph's going to wear. You know, he's going out as a woman tonight. Oh, do we, does he have his outfit? He doesn't have the whole outfit, but I saw his shoes. <laughs> They're really pretty. They don't show when, his feet enough, though. When is that happening? I think tonight. They're going out and shooting. And Fabian's going to come in? Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow morning we're going to have all that. We'll have the tape of it and everything. Oh, wonderful. Ralph lost the Super Bowl bet, so he has to dress up in panties and Fabian. dress, mini dress. and. Mini hey, Ralph, come in and show Robin your uh, high heels. Very pretty. Uh, what size shoe does he wear? Are these gigantic high heels? Not that big. <laughs> He's going to be the biggest, ugliest girl. Rough, a dainty girl. Show your booties. Your girl boots. They're manly. Let's see. Aren't those precious? Oh, aren't they cute? Ooh, and that's about a five-inch heel. Look at this heel. Did you go with Fabian to buy those? Yeah. Fabian's this guy who cuts my hair, and he's a transsexual. Or a tra transvestite. No, no. no he, what is he? He just, he just does shows. I mean, he oh, doesn't like... He doesn't walk around like that during life. Yeah. He doesn't? He's a transvestite. Yeah. Uh, no, he's a... He's a uh, it, there's so many classifications. See, Ralph's really getting into it. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm finding out everything. <laughs> well, when Fabian's here, he'll tell us what he is. All right, because the transvestite just dresses up in women's clothing. Yo, no, if, you say, if, you say to this like guy, if you say to this guy, Fabian, you're transvestite, he'll be like, Darling, what are you talking about? You don't no. know? I don't dress up. I dress up only for work. That's it. There's queens, there's trannies, there's transvestites, there's transsexuals. There's... Ralph getting sucked what into the you? whole world. Yeah, what exactly are you? I'm some poor idiot figured... who lost a bet. <laughs> Have they figured out your classification? Homo. <laughs> <laughs> no, but he just... Dominic called me the other night. He goes, I feel really bad about the bet. I go, why? Why are you having bad feelings? Because Ralph was raped when he was a young boy by a priest. <laughs> I, go, I go, Dominic, what are you talking about? And he was dead serious. He goes, you heard his story. I go, he said... He went into a room with a priest. The priest got in bed with another boy, and, and he, he slept, slept on the floor. floor. He goes, <laughs> <laughs> I said, don't you believe know? it for a minute. He said, don't you know? That's, the, that's denial. You mean there was no other boy? Yeah. <laughs> Ralph was the boy in the bed. There was no denial. I would have remembered that. <laughs> what do you, you even said you're having some memories that no, aren't too was, clear. Yeah, About was, a camera or something? No, no, no. It was, uh, it, oh, he what? Was, he was what did you really, tell me back in the office? A cam no, I was joking when I said oh, a camera. Oh, oh. Oh, I, I just he, right. That priest used to always like... Oh, he was like fuzzy. hissy, like he not me, like but he'd like he was always like hugging like kids and stuff. I mean, it was Did really. Did he hug you, Ralph? Uh, Tell I don't the know, truth. Maybe I don't remember. <laughs> he hugged. Oh boy! See, all of a sudden, but, he, you know, he, doesn't, he doesn't want to remember. Yeah, but, he's, you, like, you know, he's like he's like pushing this yeah, out yeah, of his it's, mind. It's like it's like if a parent hugs you, it's like okay, you know. I don't understand something. But after that, I never let the guy go near me. Your mom said you needed a, a male role model because yeah, your dad left you at an early age. This guy was a counselor. He was a priest. He yeah, was, yeah, yeah, right. But right. you know, he but also he decided served, to take on a camping trip. He also served as a counselor, so. I would go every once in a while and talk to him. My mother thought that I needed counseling. To, <laughs> no, you know, she you know. wasn't off of that. Yeah, it's just yeah. who she chose. Yeah. So, so she sent you to a priest. Yeah. A guy, you know, do, now, are women naive? In his office. Don't most women realize that most priests are gay? No, I now, think now, they, this they, is they... a small. This was a small town. This was our parish. You know, it, it was classic. I mean, it was. You like, know how many guys study for the Jesuit priesthood? And they they're homos, and they don't want to admit it to themselves. And then when they do, they leave the priesthood. A lot of them do that. Some of the, the honorable ones. The honorable ones do. I know a real honorable one who did that, but I'm not talking about that yet. <laughs> Dominic's on the phone. Oh, there he is. Hey, Dominic. I really do feel bad. I know you think I'm joking. You think Ralph was raped? Well, Dominic, what do you think happened? Well, you know, you, know, you may be in denial because you even said you didn't remember how it ended. No, no, because you can't even remember. So, so okay. Yeah, you so don't wait. remember how you got to that room. So your mom sends you over to the priest. He decides to take you on a camping trip because you're so screwy. <laughs> and your mom goes, "Yeah, sure, just take him for a couple of nights." The next no. thing you know, you're not even on a camping trip. You're in the priest's bedroom. It was late. We, we were going to get an early start. Yeah, like he couldn't get an early start. He couldn't he pick her up. He couldn't pick you up at the house. Yeah, you had to sleep over. Well, hey, this but is your mother naive or what? But he had the four. Isn't on my she? Mom. Hey, sorry, dude, but your mom is naive. Uh, I want to get an early start. Wait, wait, so you know, what, all what? the kids see this all behavior. Right. The parents don't. If an adult asked my daughter to sleep over mm -hmm. because they have to get an early start, I don't care if they're a teacher or what they are. I mean, wait, just because they're a teacher, your they're kid, not perverted? Your kids ever go on sleepovers? Yeah, with other little kids. Well, yeah. so, so, so there was another little kid there. But, your, but your priest is we making no a sense. Sleepover. He has to have an early start. Well, no, hey. I mean, you, how far did you live? <laughs> about 
Two minutes. Two minutes. I mean, he could have picked you up. What do you mean early start? <laughs> he wanted to get an early start on me. Nice big, yeah, right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> the night before. Let's start now. Mm. But in fairness, in fairness to his mother, that Holy was a time where people weren't as aware. Yeah. But all four characteristics are there for sexual abuse. One, man of authority. Right. Two, secrecy. Yeah. Three, reward and four, enticement. And the enticement was, remember, he even showed him the dirty books. Right. Right. How, where's secrecy? What, you well, mean, the secrecy is he tells you not to tell anyone. No, he didn't tell me that. Oh, yeah, he told you, go tell the world I'm showing you dirty no, books. He, no, he didn't. No, nah, he told you. I, I, I don't remember. Ah, uh, you don't remember. No, it was a long time, time ago. Right. right. I mean, I don't remember a lot of other Come things on, from when I was Come on, when a priest there. does stuff like this, you remember. Yeah. Well, no, you try and block no, you it don't. out. You don't, want to, you don't want to remember What are you blocking out? Bro, he's whole... blocking out the whole story. The whole, he's blocking the whole, out. The whole incident. We can't figure out. All we know is he ended up on the floor, but we don't know what happened after that. I don't sit and savor. It like he it was a magic even moment. What he was wearing on the floor, Ralph. I, what Ralph, I'm wearing. Take, let me take you through well, this I again. Let nice me take you through this again. First of all, you you do block out what happens, <laughs> and that's how you. Button. That's how a child's body is able to handle it. They become dysfunctional. The only way we can do it if we hypnotize them back. Now, mm. I was thinking of forgiving the bet, but I can't. I just can't. Yeah, you got to go through but it anyway. What I will do in the alternative is not insult or tease him for an entire year. Oh. Really? Yep. And he can say all the fat jokes he wants. You, Dominic, let me be I serious was, for a second. Dominic, let me be serious for a I second. Are you saying to me, and, I, and don't do this for the radio. Right. Did you think Ralph was, was molested and yeah. abused by this priest? Yes. And I'm being very serious. And I also think that, that, that you know, that, and I really, now I regret the things I said. I feel like Jackie apologizing to his wife. <laughs> You mean when you called Ralph a homo and stuff? I feel bad now. Because you feel the priest turned him into a homo. No. Dominic, can we, can we sue the priest? Well, if you'll go to hypnosis and we'll try to do a recapture of the memory, the first time you discover it may, there's a lot of changes in statute of limitations. You know, I have the largest verdict in this area, but what I would like to do is, is, is try it. How much money? For the Let me get this straight, Dominic. You're, are you being serious? If Ralph gets hypnotized... And they find out that he was molested? Well, there's different... I wasn't molested. There's different... Calm down. Calm down, man. You had a horrible experience. <laughs> How much money did you get for that person? Well, there's different... You know, first we have to see if we can fall within the statue and where it occurred, because I think it's interesting, because I was thinking about it. Didn't it happen in New Jersey? Yes. Yes. Well, that's a better state. We have a longer statute than New York, I think. New York, there's a 10-year there's a limit. And there's changes in the legislature. He may not be, he may have to be hypnotized to come back to realize it. You see, when the child is abused, the child is only a little person, and at that moment, that person blocks the memory by, by regressing over it. So if we regress it... So when Ralph was raped, he could have blocked the whole thing out. He wasn't raped. He may not have been raped, but he certainly... He might have been fondled. Yeah, he the, might have been... What the like trick is... <laughs> right, the abuse... Ralph, you don't even know? know. No, he did. Let, wait a but let me get this straight. So you go into the priest's room. Yes. All right, let's review, okay? Just to make sure we're all talking about it. Ralph was going on a fishing trip. R what is it, Jack? Right. Jackie has a question. Some kind of selection process. If the priest had two boys in there, at some point there had to be a determination, this one will go in the bed with me and this one will go on the floor. I well, let me, let me back up. I, let me go back. I think the one no, no, who was no, there with him Jackie. already had done something with him before. The, the, now, why do you say that? Because he, cause, he, cause he like, just hopped into bed with him. And, and, like, I don't know, he had been, like, around. I know that he I had... Remember. I know that he, he only had remembers the other boy's experience. With the yeah, the other boy is Ralph, you know. <laughs> no, but Ralph. That's, that's what he did. He swear, made him I another boy. I swear to God, boy. I would remember if no, I could. Don't, don't be bed. embarrassed. I'm no, not embarrassed. Would. I would admit it. Maybe you don't know. Day. You might not know. And that's a typical. I would know if I went into that bed or not. No, you wouldn't. And Ralph, that's a typical trick to take one boy who's been abused. And then let you think that that's a normal process. That's right. Right, right. Showing the magazine. Yeah, magazines. hey, it's no big deal to hop in. Ben, you might right. have been so freaked out by what happened to you that night that you blocked it out. Yeah, the priest was just softening you up. And the magazines titillate you, but you don't know why you're being excited. I wasn't. They, they didn't titillate me. Well, I wasn't but that's what he's hoping will be. Right. He wants, to start, he wants to get the topic onto sex. And the point is, yep. he he was Ralph's counselor. He had already had Ralph in his clutches, right. pouring out his heart. And it's obvious Ralph's very feminine. And and he could tell that Ralph was vulnerable. I was very manly. Then. And look, look at the profession you chose. You, you blow my hair out. You're a hairdresser. Yeah. I mean, glorified hairdresser. <laughs> I didn't but choose it. just kind of happened. Well, exactly. I was, I was serving. Why do you think it went that way? 
It's the same thing with the priest. You just fell into it. Yeah. Well, yeah. question of authority. control over my So you're life. saying you feel so bad for Ralph that you really genuinely believe he was molested as a child? I think it's a good possibility, and I'm sorry I said the things I've said all the time. Yeah, aren't you ashamed of yourself? I'm that. not sorry you said them. <laughs> you enjoyed them. Yeah, I'll still say them. <laughs> I feel a little bit. So, Donald. all right, let me get this straight. Hey, I don't think let's you get feel this, bad. Let's get the story straight. What did you just say? I said I don't think you feel bad, but I, I think you're... No, that's not true. I do feel bad. I can tell. His well, boy, Dominic, don't No, feel... he told me on the phone the other night he felt really bad, and I thought he was joking at first, no. and I'm telling you, this is exactly how he was. Well, does that, Dominic, does that mean I don't have to get dressed up tonight? No, no. <laughs> I, I thought about that, and, you know, I discussed it last night with Super Agent Don Buckwall, and <laughs> I can't let you out of the bed. It's just too much of the public wants No, it. Dominic, I'm into it. Uh, yeah, he's getting into it. He feels pretty. You should see these heels I got. I went for the big ones. You should go down to a monastery and parade around like that. <laughs> <laughs> so wait a second, Bought Ralph. Let me get some, give yeah, me this go straight. back over the story again. Let me get this straight. So you're in the. So you're over there that night, right? And the priest says to you and your little buddy, "It's just you and your friend, right? It's just two guys." Well, okay. I, whenever I got dropped off, it was late. You know, I don't know what time. Right. And then I went into the. Rectory and into his office. The rectumry. The rectumry. And then I went into his office. Right. And the, the other guy was already there. Right. And they were like hanging around. And I don't know if they were already looking at magazines or what, but at some point, a drawer opened up. How weird is that when your priest is showing you naked, naked magazines? Early magazines? By the way, that's a defense mechanism. You what? called him another guy. He's actually another child. Right. So he's trying no, to make he, it like no, an adult. He, he, yeah, he, to me he to me he was like he was like two years. Why old. is that a defense mechanism? Well, because he wants to try to make it an adult situation when it's really a child situation. Right. Go ahead. Dominic knows a lot about this stuff, Ralph. Open yourself I'm up to You know, yeah. I'm, start, I'm starting to buy it. You know, sort of think Dominic was raped. I don't know. All yeah, right. I see how Dominic, Dominic was raped. Good lawyer. He Dominic was spin on it. Wait a minute. Dominic just admitted. What? Uh, remember, I always tell a story. My mother would let me have grated cheese on my pasta. Oh, please. No, I thought it was when you were raped with a meatball hero. <laughs> 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 That's why you eat so much. Did you get my envelope? <laughs> what? Yeah, I did. I did. Okay, good. All right, anyway, so, Ralph, you're in the... Rectum Ray. <laughs> you walk in, and to your best of your recollection, you say they were already probably looking at some nudie magazines, and the drawer popped open, and there were more girly, but it was girl magazines, right? It was naked girls. Um, yeah, yeah. It wasn't like it wasn't like homo mags. Okay. And you're looking at them, and like, <laughs> you know how weird that is when the priest. The priest is doing well, that. It you was, know better than that. Well, they're yeah, that's not supposed to be right. No, they're sitting they're in his in office. office. No, they're but in an office. you know, and, he's, 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 and where is the priest sitting well, behind the desk? Yeah, that's. Normal. And where are you guys sitting? Is he looking at the magazines or is he looking over your shoulder? The kid on his lap. No, he was like, I think he was kind of like at his desk, and the other kid was like in a chair somewhere. It was kind of like an office in yeah. the rectory, and he was at his desk, and he opened up the drawer, and there was these magazines in it, and. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Come on, man. Dude, don't be a baby. Don't be embarrassed. He can't even talk about it. Yeah, no kidding. The other, the other kid was over sitting in a chair, and then I came in. I don't know. We sat down. We started talking or something, and I don't know. At some point, he, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if they were already looking at him or he pulled him out. He's like, here. But where were you out. sitting? Were you where sitting next to the priest? As, as, as a, I don't know. Opposed to where you were. I don't know exactly. Are you, but were you sitting near each other? Judge Can Rigo, I, I you? cannot re No, come on. Did Ralph, he touch work with me. you in any way? <laughs> no, he didn't touch me. No, I'm just saying, did he rub your back or well, something? Say, here, Ralph young man. Yeah, it. Ralph obviously can't remember a lot about this night. Yeah. But would you like to know why the priest shows the magazines? Because, the ex and this is done in studies, it excites the pedophile to think that he is turning a heterosexual child into a homosexual oh. child because in his mind... He's in denial that he's really a pedophile and a homosexual. What is it, John? I got a guy, got a guy on the phone who who also you know knows Ralph, you know that the same passion he has, and uh, you know and, and he has some stories too about this guy, that, you know, the, uh, you know the same priest and everything. Who, who, who is it? Um, Ralph, well, don't give the guy. Maybe yeah. the guy doesn't want his name yeah. on the air. Ralph, maybe the guy doesn't. Go ahead, John. Thanks. Let me see this. I want to identify the church. I don't want to identify the church. And I just give me your first name. Pat. All right, Pat. You know you Pat. Know uh, is your last name begin? Yeah, wait, 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 your last name I, begin with a D? No. I know you. I know your sister. Huh? But anyway. All right. So what happened to you? Well, what is the what is the priest's first name? Begin? I don't want no, 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 to identify. No, 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 what does his last name begin with? I, H. Okay. Yeah. All right. Go ahead. Wow. 
Wow. <laughs> Dominic's <laughs> licking his chops. He's smelling a big case. While this is going on. <laughs> <laughs> Are you eating or you're wowing to the case? <laughs> Wait a minute. Irma, would you put down? I want to know who this is, is Pat. Put the, put, the second, <laughs> put the second helping down. That's the first time I ever heard Dominic say, put the he's second helping down. Food. I think he smells a case. Anyway, so what happened to you? Well, nothing really directly with me, but uh, friends of mine uh, verif verified. I mean, we talked about it on the playground. You know, we were playing during recess, and someone mentioned something about him, and like four of us were like, "Yeah, that happened to me too." <laughs> like, what? He showed you pictures. Yeah, he had he had magazines, and he had um, eight millimeter porno movies. I, I <laughs> never saw. Them. I never I never got the film show. Yeah, I never saw them, but a friend said they were in this drawer. In his, uh, in the rectory room. Yeah, I guess that was the big drawer. Now, he also pulled out, like, some kind of mechanisms or something. I don't know what they did or what. The vibrators? You know, it's funny. It's hard to remember this. Ralph, you said that more than once, that there were mechanisms. Right, yeah. And yet you can't identify them because those are the things... Because I didn't blocking. know what they... No, because... You're blocking because they were used on him. Use if, if, on somebody, if somebody showed you a, 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 a vibrator at five years old, would you know what it was? <clears throat> Today I would. Not unless it fit on a hero. But wait a minute. Let me do one more thing. <laughs> Let me just say another thing. You know what? Ralph gave in so fast, the priest didn't need the movies on him. <laughs> I, 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 get a on. I don't think Ralph, I think Ralph was easy. He didn't take long to look at the device. Well, the tra two tragedies. Pat, were you a migrator or like? No. Every H how time much an adult chooses a child, yes. what he's really doing is choosing his life over that child's life. And pedophiles. Do know how to pick vulnerable children. They are experts at it. Wouldn't you pick Ralph if you? Well, Ralph is a, Ralph's a naive adult. So <laughs> right. Ralph had a, had a matriarchal family, and he had women around him. No, it has nothing to do with that guy. Well, he might choose other people. Also, the priest. This guy chose a lot of people. Wow. I think this There's is a popper race. Trying yeah, but, to get caught. But Ralph was an easy mark, is what yeah. Dominic's saying, because the mom was looking for a role model for Ralph. So they, that's why he, Ralph he got to sleep over. He delivered him into his yeah. hand. Yeah. yeah. The truth is, everybody trusted this priest. I mean, parents, everybody. Yeah, of course, because he's the priest. But meanwhile, he's just some dude. Yeah, but, but I love how people get caught up in his religion. All it is is a title. They don't know who but the dude is. A, a guy in a monkey suit. He was like. priest comes into town, he automatically gets. Trump. Yeah, right. He, just he was him. like the it's head cuckoo. guy. He was like above everyone. He was like yeah. bit higher than the principal. All right, so wait a second. Let me get something straight. So let's go back to that night. So then you're not all priests do that. Ninety percent. Yeah. Now, 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 Pat, were the other stories that you heard were they just like the same? Like he like whipped out the magazines, or was there like some kind of fiddling around with these other guys? Well, I think he knew I wasn't receptive to it, so I really didn't. What did he do to you? Like um, nothing personally, but. He just showed you the magazine. But you yeah, said but you I, weren't receptive. I slept over. I slept over one night. Oh. Yeah, what happened? What happened Were there? Were you in the bed with him? <laughs> yeah. Were you really? I mean, I was innocent. I didn't know what. Yeah, right. No, no. Home. Take it easy. No one's calling you a homo. Nobody's accusing you of anything. How it was it that bed like gigantic? I know it has nothing to do with being a homo. That's what I'm telling you. But these that's guys cool. think that's what. Listen, you're saying so you ended up in the bed with the guy? Yeah. With another friend. No kidding. <laughs> and, and again, look at the word Ralph uses. Fiddle around. Yeah. It's sounding more and more like Disneyland. I know. It sounds actually... So you get into the bed with the guy, so he starts trying some stuff on you? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Uh, no. <clears throat> he didn't. He's like, but he did stuff to the other kid as though the kid has done it many times. I see. Again. Nothing, nothing, like he kissed the kid, and I was like, oh, I, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Yeah, right. In the, on remember, the mouth? Yeah. No. Did you tell? Did you oh. tell it? That you, you must have. You were afraid, right? Like, I was like horrified. I didn't know. Yeah, what it was like. Yeah, it was horrifying because it's like. And then I had to spend the night there on the, and then go somewhere with the next day. I just wanted to go home. Yeah. But I didn't want to like, like why are you coming home? My mother. Why why are you coming home? I didn't want to have to tell her like. I would have run. Father. <laughs> Guess what, Mom? Father Homo's. Uh, <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> How old was the kitty kiss? How old was the kitty kiss? Seventh grade. Oh, oh, an, an older boy. That's okay. Big <laughs> <laughs> deal. Um, Robin, it's interesting take... that he always did the same thing. He liked to be watched, too. Yeah. So he'd bring another kid to watch and then have his sleeping party. He wasn't even... Well, he was pretty brazen. Yeah. yeah. Sounds like he wanted to get well, who, caught. Yeah. Absolutely. Who, you kids were who was the other, who, I'm just, who was the other kid he was kissing? What's his I, first I, name? No, don't, don't, don't do that. Stop, Ralph. Ralph, what are you gossip? Robin, Ralph's like, I'm Ooh. just curious if it was the same guy. He was kind of... What I'm, what I'm, the point I'm making is that Ralph is not lying. 
No, I didn't think Ralph was lying. I think there's more that went on with Ralph and this priest that he knows about. Well, not necessarily, because the guy, he knew who he could take advantage of. Yeah, but does he how you remember everything? I don't. I really don't remember everything. (laughs) Uh (laughs) Uh-oh. Maybe you had him. Hey, Dominic, there's a big case here. Well, Robin, did you, you said a moment ago that you would run, but if an older male abused you when you were a child, and you had no one to tell, and you couldn't tell, let's say, you, your mother because she wouldn't be able emotionally to handle it. You wouldn't right. know what to do. You think Robin knows right? all about it. Right. Read a book. But I, this is a priest. This is a guy down the street. You got a mother you yeah, can run to. Don't be so hard. No, 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 you'll read her book. You're, you're going to be opening yourself yeah. up to a lot of questions lately, too, you know. You think you're going to be on the hot seat in a couple of weeks. <laughs> you'll be under hypnosis. <laughs> I don't need any hypnosis. We're going to be asking you the same question. I remember any device. <laughs> Robin, that laugh is a good defense. <laughs> there you go. You're absolutely right, Dominic. I know. But She's crying inside. I would have had an older man that took him on his bed when he was 16 or 15. Bro. That's true. The We're all complete. victims. Who did? <laughs> you. Did. The circle's co- it's in your book. Some guy comes over and wants to show I wasn't 16 or 15, you nitwit. Oh, well, yeah, I might have been about seven. They were okay. dating. You dummy. <laughs> you know what? Go eat a hot dog. And I was dummy, huh? You know what, man? I see a dog full of blood, I run. I see a priest showing nude pictures to another kid, I run. That's it. Hey, you know what? That anger is a good defense mechanism, too, isn't it, Dominic? But, but that's where I've, you know what? I'm just angry. Nobody ever showed me any naked pictures. You know what? I was just uncomfortable. I was. I didn't feel threatened, and he wasn't coming on to me. It wasn't yeah. like he was rubbing me and saying, "Let me yeah, sure. take your." Yeah, but he I was, thought you didn't mean just, the other day you didn't was, remember. He was just being like one of the guys that thought. And you like, hopped out of the bed. You hopped out of the bed. I didn't the device. Hop, I wasn't is, wait a minute. I wasn't the device the came out, and Ralph doesn't remember what happened. And then no, he was just he was, he was just like proudly displaying them. He wasn't saying like this is what you do with it, and he wasn't demonstrating. Dude, just dude, like, oh, I got this stuff. Hold on. Let me say something, Ralph. That's not fair. Yeah, Ralph. Sure, right. Let me tell you something, Ralph. Ralph. You have not been raised in Catholicism, so you don't understand the power. Oh, I was half Catholic. Be quiet. Let me tell you, I understand the power. Oh, I I don't understand the power of anything. No, I didn't say. Oh, okay. I don't understand the power of authority. Oh, shut up. He's the authority on everything. No, no, no. Mr. Law degree. Now he's a psychiatrist. I can't believe that the entire community stayed quiet. Not one person could. Let me ask you. You know so much. How come you eat so much? Let me ask you something. Yeah, what are you hiding from? Yeah, what are you? What what went on in your youth? No, my wife's God, What? I won't talk about my personal life. Oh, well, <laughs> yeah. it's probing everybody else's life. Yeah. Uh, you know so much that I don't know about human nature. Well, why is it you've never sat down and analyzed why you eat so much? You know what? It's interesting. I've hit everyone on the table. They're all turning on me. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. Look these... I'm going to hang up on you in a minute, and that's your, it'll be your biggest punishment. You're not opening up. Well, you know, why did you open up? What happened to you, you know, the priest? Look at this. I've got Yeah. A, a priest raped him with a hot dog. <laughs> oh, goodness. Everything had to do with food. I got to eat more. The priest made Dominic take 500. My wife said, my wife yeah. just, ever just said, you're 100% right. He must have been abused on the kitchen table. <laughs> Did the priest make you eat 500 communion wafers? <laughs> I wasn't raised that way. <laughs> but that is true, that, that the, the Catholicism gives that person a great deal of authority. Fat people are usually victims of sex abuse? No. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. come on. You know that. They're Distorted hiding. body image. That's right. <laughs> Out of control. Most women who are overweight have had some problem. Yeah, but I'm not a woman. Well, oh, look at this. try and find your penis. <laughs> you actually having me defend myself. This is very interesting. Yeah. We, we, yeah. Hang up. <laughs> Ralph, <laughs> let me just understand something. You saw, the, you saw the vibrators and stuff or devices. You saw the magazines. The period between... After you've seen the magazines, and then somehow the kid ends up in bed, is blank to you. No, it's not that it's blank, but nothing, nothing of Did you change happened. clothing in front of the priest? How no. did you get your jammies? I don't remember, Your Honor. Let me ask a question. He doesn't remember, remember the evening. If yeah. the situation was I so know. intimidating, at, at what point do you tell a priest, no, I'm not getting the bed with you two? If it was that huge a bed, and that was... Oh, was let me tell I'll tell you how it went. No, because I was getting on the phone. After the devices, after the devices... Ralph's, he said, let's all change into our pajamas and wash up. Ralph's there naked. Pictures were taken. Oh, pictures? Ralph was probably in the bed nude. (laughs) There were no pictures taken. There was probably abuse. 
And then Ralph, after he, after the guilt of the abuse and after his orgasm, yes. he, laid down, oh, he said, I'm getting back onto the floor. You know, you're a dick. And then he you know, dressed it up, and then they had like another session. I was hoping to be and the only thing he remembers is getting out of the bed. Well, there was no fishing, was there? Was, yeah. Uh, no time for fishing. And fishing, fishing for Ralph. Fishing for me. Fishing for Ralph's worm. Fishing for trouser trout. You know, Ralph, he ruined the bed for me. <laughs> now you're going to beat up Ralph for being an abused I'm child? I'm looking forward to it. Oh, mm. All right, oh, anyway. No. Oh, come on. Dominic, man. thank you so much. And tomorrow is the big... And, sir, thank you for calling in and corroborating Ralph's story. Wow, Ralph. <laughs> let, wow. Me see your, let me see your heels that you're wearing tomorrow. Wow, wow what? Nothing... Those heels don't show your pretty feet, Ralph. Ooh. I don't think my feet are that pretty. <laughs> let me see your feet. <laughs> Why do you wear open toe shoes? Yeah, a little toe cleaner. Because so, and paint your nails nice and red. Fabian really sold me on these. Yeah, those are cute. You're going to look really yeah, darling. Have to. In now, wait a second. By the way, I'm not like Dominic. I don't feel bad for you at all. No, I don't either. <laughs> Listen, there's this, guy, there's this guy at the store who who had had a similar... He was like trying... You know, this shop that we went to to get these, this other shop... That's all they, they sell to transsexuals or whatever. And so there's some guy in there, mm -hmm. and he's trying to pair on. But this guy looked like like Dan Haggerty. <laughs> I mean, he was like right. full facial hair, and right. he's like strutting around in the in those things. Yeah, and he wasn't, you know, he didn't lose a bet. Obvious, you know. Yeah, he was there for and, and enjoyment. And he also wasn't dressing up like a girl. You know, he was a man. And I don't know. Yeah, weird. Just weird wanted the shoes, huh? Did we get that on tape? Did you trying on different boots and stuff? No, you know, you know why? Because I didn't know I'd have to get them yesterday. Because Fabian said, you know, you have to get them today and walk around with them for a little while. No, no, no. Just get everything on tape, will you? Yes, you, even your rehearsals of walking. The, the things that you know, no, no, I, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't walked around in them. Did you buy a pair of shoes? Yeah. Did you go with Fabian to buy the shoes? Yes. Get it on tape. Sorry. You don't know what you're doing. Sorry. You're gonna shave for your. Uh... Yeah, I yeah, have you have to. Just too much hair on your face. I'll do that in camera. All right. Well, tomorrow we'll find out how it was when you dress up in panties. Maybe this will bring back memories. <laughs> and he's going to uh, he's going to tunnel bunny and do a lot of other things. Uh, for the record, I know nothing. Oh, Ralph else Roman happened with you. the yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, for the record, you don't remember for the what rectory. happened. For yeah. the rectum. <laughs> Thank you. What is it, Papa Foley? I have to take a break. Our guest is here. Who is our guest? <laughs> Susan Olson. Oh, oh yeah, right. Cindy Brady. Yeah. Oh. She wants to stop by and say hi. And we always enjoy it when she does. Yeah. I don't get to put my heels on. So you're going out tonight, right? Yeah. Okay. Late tonight. And he's going to go to some, you know, transsexual clubs and parties. Maybe. Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. He's going to get into the whole life. Oh yeah, he's going to he's going to experience gay lifestyle. <laughs> I'll have to see. I'll have to see how much I have to drink. What are you wearing for a dress? I'm going to try in a bunch of different outfits. I didn't really want to, you know. You don't want to spoil the fun, right? right. You know, I want to save that for later. Do you think there's any chance that Ralph goes over to that side and never comes back? It's possible. You know, it's possible you know, that he never lets go of that outfit in those pair of shoes. You feeling shaky about it? I mean, you're gonna have to go out and, you know, the ask only guys thing for I'm, sexual. <laughs> the only thing I'm no, I don't, the only thing I'm feeling shaky about is like it's really uncomfortable. Like these boots are like really hard to walk and almost impossible. Really? Let's see. Put them on. Yeah, let's see you walk around. Do your thing. Strut your stuff. <laughs> He's going to dress up like a girl tonight and go out and ask guys if they need sex. <laughs> now, what do, now, what do but I he's have? going to clubs, too. Now, now, should I just, like, stand there and, like, wait for them to approach me? I mean, I don't, I'm not real clear. No, you should I, go up and make no, you gotta, you're, you're in. What is that you're putting on? <laughs> what are those, man? Those little hoes. My, are those hoes? Yes, look at Oh, that. you hideous. <laughs> you are, you are so homo, man. <laughs> Why do you have to wear fishnets? I feel good. Is that what Fabian told you to wear? Hey, yeah. Yeah. He knows his stuff. I'll give him that. What are all the girls wearing? <laughs> They're like, you look. What so happened when this guy, Fabian, who, who cuts my hair and is also yeah. dressing Ralph up? Yeah. Um, Ralph called him up and said, oh, man, I lost a bet, and I, and I got to dress up like a girl. And what did he say to you? Darling, you won. <laughs> <laughs> and he's not a transvestite. Oh, no. <laughs> and then we're going to get these shoes yesterday, and he's like, he's like, he grabs my arm. He goes, oh, he goes, this is great. He goes, I, I, never, I never went shoe shopping with a heterosexual or some of those straight guy. Tell him he still has them. <laughs> <laughs> I said to him, well, that's in question. Yeah, all right. You seem to be enjoying this a little too much. Oh, and he's trying to put a good face on it. You think? I think so. Let me see. Where's your booties? I didn't booties. How long does it take you to get into your boots? Hey, man, Dude, I'm in Russia a little bit. I'm doing a show. I'm trying here, man. All right, hurry up. You know, yeah, Ralph, you're always stretching that air time. Like a woman. Yeah. <laughs> It takes, it takes forever to get dressed. We're all standing and waiting. Let's see how pretty Maybe your feet look, Ralph. Maybe he'll have Ralph. more sympathy for his dates now. Oh, it's like impossible. 
Come on, man. Get your booties on, man. See what girls Look, Prince doesn't uh, complain like that. Robin, those are actually kind of nice boots. I was going to say, maybe I'll keep them after Ralph if he'll let them go. Yeah, I, I don't doubt think it. so. <laughs> These are in my wardrobe now. Mm, you look so pretty. <laughs> all right, let me see you walking them. Want to lick my heels? Don't tie them all the way up. Just need to stand up. Just well, you have to or there. you can't walk. Dude, you're not going to walk. Oh, he needs stupid. the ankle support. Yeah. Let me see. Stand you, on the you, counter. <laughs> walk around. Let me Wait, see. Who makes you makes your calves look pretty? It looks, it looks like maybe you should walk down the hall, Howard, and have Ganji get. Are you it. gonna it shave your legs, like dude? Calves, you gotta shave your legs. I like the way it lifts your ass. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you look nice. So walk a little bit, Ralph. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you look pretty. <laughs> Put a book on your head. Like, boom. <laughs> He was it, it was he was trying to tell me how to walk like you have to like, I don't, I don't, I don't. Open the business back there. <laughs> Are you gonna shave your legs? You got hairy legs. No, I'm just gonna wear hose. Oh <laughs> you can see that hair. Needs a fella. Oh my. <laughs> Needs a fella. Likes boys. You want Likes to, priest. You want a date, Jackie? All right, let's take a break and Forget we'll be back. No, he's not going to make it out of Tomorrow day. should be fun as we learn about the story and he's what happened. Yeah, we'll be what back. happened to Ralph last yeah. night on the town? We'll be back uh, right after these words.